I cannot believe that just happened. I cannot believe it because these wings took me so long. And they're not even even. What the fuck is up everybody? My name is Kaya and today I'm going to be doing my makeup with you guys. I'm about to do something fun and bold and bright and just we're gonna have a good time. So I am going to be using the Alien palette today. Looks like these, you know, beautiful, beautiful these on the inside. I don't know what colors I want to use, but they all match my hair, yeah. so it faded. I washed it one time, so I don't know how I feel about it. So yeah, we're gonna move on. I accidentally dipped into black hole. I'm about to do something fun and bold and bright, and so I'm just gonna go ahead and put it on my face, and we're gonna make that work. We're gonna make it work, okay? So I'm gonna be taking black hole, and I'm gonna be putting it all along the inside of my eyeball, because why didn't why not? You know what I'm saying? I feel like this this is one of those things that, one of those things that you just gotta try out, you know, see if you like it, which we're gonna find out. I don't usually use black. I think it's very dark and it makes me kinda nervous, but we'll see. Honestly, <laughs> honest, I don't use black because there's a lot of fallout, but so far I've only got one little dot on my face, which is not bad. Not bad at all. Do you see that? Got it. <laughs> that was pretty good fallout, to be honest. Hey, that's pretty good. All right, now I'm about to do the same thing to the other side. I'm just gonna put black hole all along the crease. Wait a minute, who are you? No, all in my lid, that's right, not on my crease. Don't put it in your crease. You put it in your crease, yeah, not following the look. You're not following the tutorial. I don't know where I'm going with this. That was like a awful New York accent and roast me for it, I don't know, but that was terrible. Okay, so we're acting like that never happened. Um, I'm watching a lot of TV lately, I don't know if you can tell. And, um, there's been a lot of accents coming my way. I watch a lot of Gordon Ramsay TV shows, and so there's a lot of people that go on there and they have different accents, and I'm not even gonna lie to you. It's very fascinating. I need more black. More. Mm, yeah, not anymore on this side. <laughs> That's weird. It's crazy. Let's put some more. I don't know. I don't know. I don't, I don't know what I'm doing with this look. I think I'm trying to make it look dark because the gray in my hair, it disappeared. And it makes me want to cry. And I just, I don't want to have to re-dye my hair because if it's gray green right now, that means it's probably just going to be gray green when I dye it. You know what I'm saying? So I don't think there's a point. I'm not trying to do anything like chemically to my hair yet, you know? So I'm in a bit of a pickle. So next I'm gonna go ahead and take this little flat end of this brush and take Probe and I'm gonna put it in the middle of my eyeball just like that. Now I'm gonna do the same thing on the other side. Since I'm already using this flat end of the brush, I'm gonna go ahead and take Pluto, which is like the white sparkly color and go ahead and do the inner corner of my eyeball because it's about to get dark. I wanna go ahead and lay that light base down so I can probably touch it up again later. Beautiful, <laughs> beautiful. I don't know what the fuck that was. It's like my inner child came out because I bought myself a little present. I'm going to my mom's house later today to go searching for something special to me. It was actually the first kind of videos I ever started making, so if you know what I'm talking about, I'm gonna be showing you a little something, something coming soon, coming soon. Okay, okay, we're gonna move on. I'm gonna take tall gray and I'm gonna put it in my crease. I feel like this is looking pretty cool, but I don't know, I wanna do more. So I'm gonna take Ghost OG actually and put it on top of where I was just putting that tall gray. Perfect. Now I'm gonna take tall gray and put it on top of that. Just as like a little blender color. And of course, you already know I'm taking Pluto as my brow bone color. I just love this color, Pluto. It's so cute. Oh my goodness. I started like pre-contouring my nose and I kinda love that. So it's pretty cool. <laughs> If I say so myself. I feel like I've been looking at this the whole time and that's kind of rude, but I can't see what I'm doing right now. So that's, this is like the important part and I'm trying to do it. So we're going to go ahead and do the same thing on the other side. I'm going to take Ghost OG and put it on top of this color in my cream. Do 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 I don't know. I don't know where I'm going with this. I mean, I really don't even know what the point of this video is. I think I'm doing a makeup tutorial. Oh my gosh. Is this like like a an actual makeup tutorial? Like one that you might actually do? Oh, this is kind of fun now. I don't know. This is kind of intimidating. Okay, let's do this. So this is Ghost OG, right? And I think I told you in my last video, the secret to doing any kind of blending 
is to go in circles. I think everybody knows this by now, but if you don't, do a circle and I promise you it'll look perfect all the time. Go do it. If you look at me the whole time, I'm doing a little circle. The whole time I put on the makeup. The whole time. So, I got a little bit right there. That's okay. It's gone now. Now I'm going to go ahead and put tall gray on top of that, as you saw me do before. Just right there at the very tippity top. Just to kind of blend it, make it a little bit lighter, because it's a dark look. You know what I'm saying? You don't want to look super, like, I mean, yeah. No, yeah, you do. Yeah, this is the whole point. You do want to look like this. Like, super dark and mysterious. Yeah, that's exactly what this is all about. So, I'm going to be taking more Pluto and just going right up in here. Oh, my bravo. I love this color. I'm not even going to lie to you. I think it's gorgeous. I guess the last step would be to pop some color into this, right? <sighs> what a better color than purple? I think that purple would look really cute and honestly, Honestly, I don't want to put green in my hair right now or on my face. I feel like that is all I have been doing. So this is like the optional step. You don't have to do this, but your girl wouldn't be your girl unless I did this step because I like to do my waterline underneath it with like an eyeshadow color because it's so cute. It's so cute. Like it's full patchy. I'm not even gonna lie. I think it's because I keep getting it wet. My eyes like, hey, who are you doing? Wabam. Did you that, that changes it. That changes it. It makes it look like better in my opinion, but you know, you can like this version of it. That's cool too. Whatever floats your boat. I watched The Life of Pi again for the first or I watched The Life of Pi for the second time um, yesterday and I just have to say it really brought me out of my little dump. It made me feel like, I don't know, not like m motivated or whatever, but like inspired, I guess is a good word. I love that movie. What in the actual fuck? Okay, I'm gonna try to take this and just like blend any harsh lines beautiful now i know what you're thinking girl you look like a mess it doesn't it doesn't stop here that's what you think that's why i do my uh eyeshadow first i don't know how i forgot what that was called um it's kind of something i do a lot and it's um literally pretty simple it's shadow for my eyeball i don't know i had a little brain fart and uh yeah that happened now I'm going to be doing my foundation all along my face. I already primed before I started this video, just so you know. But I figured you didn't want to see that step because it's been in every one of my videos. So you pretty much know what primer I use and what primer I love. So um, if you want to know, I'll put it in the description, of course. But like, it's going to be in the other videos too. So I'm just going to try to stop doing repetitive stuff. No repeats, dude. I don't know. Why did I say it like that? Repetitive. Repetitive. No more repetitive stuff. Oh, shit. Through my beauty blender. This is intense. Okay, let's do it along my eyeball. Oh my gosh, I'm sorry I got quiet. I'm trying to perfect this. This is like a magic, you know what I mean? Doing foundation is kind of like, you either got the trick or you don't. Mm -hmm. I just need a little bit more. Hello. Come on out there, buddy. Ding. This is painful. My beauty is pain. Really, literally, literally. It fucking hurt. My whole fucking hand is probably right under this, but you can't tell because it's foundation. <laughs> bum, 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 bum. Bum. I'm just trying to get my whole face one color. It shouldn't be that difficult, right? Wrong. It's crazy because like if I use a darker foundation or like a darker concealer than what um the lightest is, it makes me look like I'm like trying to look like Snooky or something. Like I got the wrong shade and <sighs> it's bad. But I love Snooky, so that was not a shade. That was just like an, an example. I'm about to take this tiny little brush and I'm gonna dip into X Files, which is just like a light brown color. And I'm gonna do my eyebrows. So, you know, this is just um, not the normal way, but your girl doesn't really care. And brows are just brows. But to some people, they're everything. I am not one of those people. So, oh yeah, I do though. I was very, very motivated to try the whole um, bleaching your eyebrows and dyeing your eyebrows. So, I kind of wanna do that. I don't know. I'm iffy, you know? But I think it would be fun. I've always wanted to do it. But now that it's like okay to do it, you know, like people do it. So, I, huh? I don't know. Seems like a lot of upkeep that I'm already kind of I can't upkeep with my hair enough though I don't know if I can upkeep with bleach in my brow. You know what I'm saying? That's um, that's a whole other pickle in a jar that I don't want to I don't want to dive into I can't I'm not ready for another pickle. I'm in a pickle with this this green speaking of pickles I just had to change my camera battery. So that's fun. Oh rude It's gonna make me look like I have a unibrow, which is cool if that's your thing, but for me not my thing Oh my goodness this is intense. My eyebrows are starting to look good again. I like plover plucked them and then couldn't save them for the longest time. And now I think they're starting to finally 
take the shape that they used to be, which makes me so happy. You have no idea. I used to have like the eyebrows that everybody wanted. Everybody would always be like, who does your eyebrows? And I'd be like, me. And they'd be like, oh, oh, okay. So yeah, mm. this one's a little bit curved. This one's not. Well, which one do I like? Yeah. It's the tails. Yeah. <laughs> okay, I see, I see. See what I did there? Now I'm just brushing some brow gel through these bad boys. Just trying to, you know, comb them out. Make sure they don't get any knots. So now I'm about to take a little bit more Pluto on the tip of my finger and just kind of dab it into my eyebrow, brow bone, stuff area. Yeah, that's exactly what I'm doing. I'm dipping it and I'm dragging it and I'm diving it. And I think I got a little bit right there. So that's okay. Dabbed it away and now my finger's back to save the day. You might be thinking, Kaya, you look a little bit pale. Yeah, no, that's the point. I'm ha I am I gotta put some blush on this face. It's bad, I know. I'm very pale and I, I, I wish that wasn't the case, um, but it is. And I can't, like, I don't tan very well. I gotta like be outside for a long time and that doesn't happen. So we don't, in this household, it's like pasty. You know what I mean? Like that's, that's the, that's the vibe. I'm kidding, I'm kidding. I don't know. It's just me and my dog, so maybe <laughs> bronzer. It's crazy how much uh, this stuff like, you know, makes your, breaks your look. You can overdo your bronzer and make yourself look like Fiona before she's beautiful. Not to say she's not beautiful as an ogre, but you can see the difference. And then like, you know, with good contour, you can look like Fiona as a human. Beautiful. May have fucked up. Breathe. I'm gonna be taking this beautiful cream highlight and trying to save the day. So I contoured a little bit too much. Now this step is obviously up to your personal preference, okay? I know everybody doesn't like to highlight to the gods like I do, but I feel like it is it makes me feel like a magical princess queen i know it makes me feel like a queen so i have to do this like this is this is this is it this is my favorite step of the whole makeup routine if i have to leave my house without doing one thing or with only doing one thing it's highlight sorry about it mascara no anything but highlight is not even flowing through my brain i'm just like oh, i gotta go highlight this face <laughs> I gotta go be shiny and sparkly. Yeah, no, that's me. I gotta go be highlighted. I like to sparkle. Oh, that is on me. I like to have like, to shine off of every single light in the building. Is it sweat? No, it's highlight. <laughs> oh my goodness, am I almost done? God damn, there's so much highlight. Now I'm gonna be taking this dandelion yellow color highlight and going all over on top of where I just put that highlight. Boom, 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 boom. What do you think? I don't know, okay? I'm kind of not feeling it anymore. I thought I was doing good and now I'm just kind of like, okay. I'm about to do some eyeliner. So we're gonna go ahead and wing it. Maybe not so perfect, but that's okay. We're making it perfect. Motherfucker, this wing will not defeat me. I will not let it, okay? I will not let it. We're gonna move on to the next wing and see if we can match that. I freaking hope so. Right, right, right. One more chance. Motherfucker. I don't understand. It's this wing. It's the top. I think I did that shit. Okay, I cannot believe that that just happened. I cannot believe that just happened. I cannot believe it because these wings took me so long. And they're not even even. Like this one's a little bit thicker than this one. And I'm gonna fix that. Fuck. Why is it still not as thick? I'm so confused. Finally, I think they match and they're literally so ugly. Like my makeup today, not cute, but the lashes might fix it. So I'm gonna glue on some lashes and I'll be right back because you don't wanna see this process. You don't wanna see it. You do not wanna see this process. I'm going to be using these, going to be using the Ardell 113 Wispy along with these tweezers and these little lash adhesive thingies. I'll see you in a second. Every single time I do my makeup, I forget to contour my nose. It's like ritual. It's always the last step for some reason and I don't know why. I don't want it to be. I just kind of forget about it. I mean, my nose is kind of cute, but like, it's still important. The contour needs to be done. I don't understand. I need to make like a little tiny note on my little thing I have right here. And my little thing is just contour your nose, bitch, because I never do it ever. And if I do it, it's always the last step. It's always forgotten about. And I'm sorry, nose. You're not, you're not forgotten about. Okay, a little bit of dust off of the nose, a little bit of highlight, never hurt nobody. And I think this is it. I think that this is my finished result. 
liked? Do you like it? Do you think I look, I think I look pretty? If you do, let me know in the comments down below. That would definitely boost my ego, you know? And we all know I need that. If you know me, you know I don't need that. But I hope you guys did enjoy this video. If you did, I have tons of makeup videos like this. And it'll be listed at the end of this video. Thank you guys so much for watching. I appreciate you guys so, 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 so much. So much so that I'm actually doing a giveaway. And there is only, I think, four or five days left. I'm announcing the winners on September 2nd. So you have a few days left to get some of these beautiful crystals. And yeah, yeah, there's a lot going on right now. You have a chance to win these bad boys. There's six baggies, six winners. Go ahead and enter lashes, okay? Just send me a DM on Instagram and let me know that you want to be in it. Thank you guys again so much for watching. I appreciate every single one of you guys so, so much. Stay rad, okay? Don't get abducted by aliens because it doesn't sound like fun. And you guys, have an amazing day. Bye-bye.